Hey YouTube, welcome to the channel and thank you for watching this video. What we have here it's uh, menu number 12 bean and rice burrito. Uh, this thing's about 20 plus years old. I had it for a while. Uh, even though it's a lunch time and I'm kind of hungry but I'm not promising I'm going to be eating it but I do want to open it up and see what's in it, what kind of condition is it in after so many years. Uh, another thing this MRE all these years hadn't been stored properly uh, most of the time it's either been in garage or storage building without uh, heat or AC so it's far from being stored in uh, perfect conditions as they recommend so let's open it up and see what's in it and if anything that's left in it it's edible see if I can open it up just by peeling it without using a knife. Yep, opened up easy. All right, so first thing that we have in it is uh, your fruit, pears. There's some kind of codes on it, but I have no idea is that production code or what those codes stand for uh, let's open up the paper package and look inside has the same thing same stamp date All right, let's see if this is edible at all. Uh, I definitely wouldn't eat it. Kind of looks like uh, somewhat rotten pears. I can't tell you what the smell is like because my uh sense of smell is almost non-existent so i'm kind of wrong person to judge something when it comes to smell but it looks kind of nasty i sure wouldn't need it so let's put that aside and uh look at this black bean and rice burrito this uh black bean and rice burrito this thing kind of was nasty and sucked even when it was fresh i didn't even like eating it back then so i can just imagine now i mean the thing's fairly hard kind of like a almost like piece of plastic let's open it up and see what it looks like It don't look that much of a different than what it looks like when it was fresh. Uh, I mean, you can tell that this uh, uh, con the packaging around it has absorbed a lot of its color. But uh, like I said, I'm not going to eat it. Uh, you can see beans in there. Oh, that thing stinks. Even I can smell that. Uh, if I can smell it... It has to be a real strong smell and I just smelled it so that's uh, not something I would recommend. Use Like I say I usually can't smell stuff but if I can smell that that's pretty bad. Uh, next thing it's a fruit bar. I'm going to have to look up these codes what year production that would be. Uh, Looks like a Kellogg's Nutri-Grain cereal bar, fruit bar. This thing's sticky. It's been leaking. Let's open it up and see what it looks like inside.
I can actually smell this a little bit. Almost takes uh, taste uh, uh, kind of like a alcohol or smells like alcohol. That's kind of impression I get. Oh, I hadn't seen one of these forever. Snickers Munch. I used to like these. Uh, I actually tried to find them outside in civilian markets to buy. I never could find uh, them to buy. Only place I could find them it was in uh, MRE bars or MRE uh, meals. It just usually just caramelized uh, peanuts. Oh, this paper looks bad. The paper's supposed to be white. It's all yellow. There it is. It's a lot darker than what I remember it to be. Uh, as far as I remember, it used to be a lot lighter in color than what it is now. Well, let's put that aside. Of course, your uh, quality spoon. Uh, these things are quality. I mean, I used to carry one with me and just kind of wipe it off and put in my body armor. Always had a spoon with me. They'll last forever. Peanut butter. I mean, this thing should be okay. I think. Let's see. It looks good. Looks normal. Let's taste it. Thing tastes fine. I would definitely eat this. You don't taste bad. It look, tastes just like fresh peanut butter. MRE, MRE heater. Crackers vegetable. I hate it. A uh, vegetable ones. I, I like uh, just your regular ones. And uh, some of them they will put this vegetable stuff or they put those kind of like a bread that tastes like crap. But uh, I would prefer the regular ones. So let's. Seems like it's still fairly good sealed. Uh, you don't look like it has lost its vacuum. So let's open it up, see if we can hear it. Oh yeah, this thing's still freshly sealed, so it probably tastes just fine. It looks fine, I mean, it's kind of crumbled up, but it looks fine. Let's take a, taste a small piece of it, see what it tastes like. Mm. Tastes a little bit uh, uh, different than what I remember it, but it still has the, has that uh, majority of the taste that I remember. It. And here's the old accessory pack, and uh, these are the ones that I remember. Came with a bunch of st things. So let's see what's in here. Got our apple drink mix. That thing's hard. Just that water. I don't think getting water will do anything to it, but uh, now it kind of turned back into powder. Iced tea drink mix, natural lemon flavor, this looks normal, probably be good, I'm not going to try it, but your uh, standard GI issue toilet paper, good to keep it in your cargo pocket. I don't even know if these new uniforms have card pockets now. And uh, Tabasco sauce. I don't think 
they come with Tabasco sauce anymore. Uh, but this uh, does kind of look a little bit darker than what I remember Tabasco sauce being. I, I don't even know if Tabasco sauce can expire or not. But you can't win it. Here's a wet wipe. Let's see. Oh, shit. It's still, still wet. Still works after all these years. Wow, it's wet just like it would be if it was fresh. Gum. Now that thing's hard, can't even break it. So I don't think that would be edible. Get a, get some pliers and see if I can break it in half. See, oh, it broke easy this time. I don't know if I would chew it or not. Matches. See if they still work. Oh, they're falling apart. Let's see. No. And pack of salt. Pack of salt should still be good. So, so that's it for uh, 20 or more years old MRE. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.